Minnesota has been waiting all week for this one. Get ready, folks. The opening kickoff is finally here. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Hurricanes have got a guy at quarterback that is a true leader. We found that out this week talking to him. We sure did, Brad. It was interesting this week and as you and I prepared for this game, finding out that he called a players-only meeting without any of the coaches just to get this team focused and let them understand what it takes to go on the road and to win this kind of game. And when you have that kind of leadership, you've got a real chance to be able to go on the road and win. From their own 25-yard line. Second down. Zips it to the tight end. He's taken down around the 33-yard line. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. But they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. Stop that hey, this is a great play here by the defense to bring him down before he can get to the sticks. Oh, excellent punt. Good job by the defense to force a punt on the first series. Boy, the crowd was loud and did their part. Now if they're able to move the ball downfield, they can take control of this game early. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. He's got it out to his tight end. They'll bring him down at the 35. They fake the handoff and complete the pass good for six yards. All it takes is a second on these play action fakes to get the defense out of position. And that's how this tight end was able to get open and pick up some yards. Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. From their own 35-yard line, third down. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. When you only need a couple of yards on third down, as a quarterback, you always want to try to find a receiver to throw to that's across the first down marker. These special teams have done it before, blocking punts. It looks like they're coming after this one. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. He fields the punt at the 16. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. Stop at about the 31. That's a gain of six on the play. That'll bring up second and Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Four down, four down. Watch one, watch one. Mike one, Mike one. Ready. He scrambles. He's to the 40. He goes out of bounds at the 41-yard line. And that was a nice pickup by the quarterback. Brent, I think this guy's amazing. He has an uncanny ability to scramble, and it showed right there on that play. They'll give it off here. Even if you're pulling for the other team, you've got to just admire this guy's speed. He is special. First and 10. First and 10. Ball on the 49. Quick throw out to the receiver. And down he goes at the 11. This is a great pitch and catch combination, and they hook up here for a big time game. First down. So the big gain resulting from the pass play leaves us with a first and ten. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Oh, one's the mic. One's Ready. Green night. Nice run there. This is 
the eighth play of this drive. They'll give it off here. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. The way the safety was playing up toward the line of scrimmage shows you what they think of the offense's passing game. Not a lot of respect for it. It's third down and seven yards to go. Ball on the eight. Brought down around the eight-yard line. Miami is looking to go up by three. The kick is up, and it splits the uprights. And you got to think they're pretty happy with holding them to a field goal right there. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. He's on the run. Runs right for a nice game. Seven yards there on the option pitch to the halfback. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Tackle made at the 41. Good job by the offensive line to pick up the linebacker on the blitz. That gave the quarterback enough time to find his man for a nice game. Taken down at the 49-yard line. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. First down grab by the receiver, and he is drilled at the 44-yard line. So the pass was complete for a gain of five on the play, and that's good enough for a first down. And I like the decision the quarterback made on this play. He didn't try to force a deep pass. Instead, he just threw a little dump-off pass that was good enough for a first down. He gets to about the 34-yard line. From the 34-yard line, first down. A tight, low-scoring game in that first 15 minutes. Let's see if things open up in the second quarter. Miami's got a three-point lead. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Three down, three down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Just throws this one away. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. The ball is loose. It's scooped up by the offense. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Yep, and this is why you need to know where the ball is at all times. Defense hoping for another sack here on third and long. Four down, four down. Watch nine, watch nine. Check 59. Dog four. Blue four. Blue four. Aaron and out long. And he's tackled right around the six yard line. This guy's combination of speed and his hands make him lethal. He can take a game over at any time. This is the ninth play of this drive. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Check 83, ball zone 83. Red, two. Seven, red, five, 59. Mike is 59. Three yard gain by the halfback on the counter play. That's good for a gain of three yards. That brings up second and goal. It's second and goal. Ball on the three-yard line. Give 
Hogan to the tailback, and he's met in the backfield. That was a loss of two yards. Makes his third and goal. It's the 11th play of the drive. Touchdown, Golden Gophers! He really plowed his way into the end zone there. Great looking touchdown. Once you get inside the 10 yard line, this halfback is automatic. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So an 11 play, 83 yard drive and it results in a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. And he's level at the 25. their own 25-yard line. Second down. Quick throw incomplete. One of his receiver. at the 42-yard line. The reception. Gain of 17 yards. First down. What was that? Are you kidding me? From their own 42-yard line. First down. Was all over that draw play. And they get very good containment on the halfback. He had nowhere to go with the football. Fires it out. He's tackled at the 48 yard line. Number 29 on the tackle at the 48 yard line. From the 48 yard line, it's first down. Hey, number eight's coming. Number eight's Mike. Here we go. He's on the run. He's at the 40. He's taken down right around the 36-yard line. That's a gain of 12 on the play. That makes it first and 10. Three down, three down. Here we go. Oh, ready. Red, 68. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. From the 36 yard line. Second down. Gains his way to the 23 yard line. That's a game of 13 on the play. It's the ninth play of the drive. So it's second and 12. Ball on the 25 yard line. And he hits him hard at the 28. That makes it third and 15. This is the 11th play of this drive. He's under some heat. 
great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. They're going to try a long field goal here. It has the distance, and he got it. Miami to kick this one off. He really got a hold of that kick. Both offenses have played it pretty close to the best so far this time. Yeah, because they've been so conservative, it's made it pretty easy for both of these defenses to be pretty dominant. Let's see an offense open it up and take a few chances. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Minnesota is up one. Got his receiver, but it's knocked down. From their own 25-yard line, it's second down. And he throws it away. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. They come out in an empty backfield. Red to green. Quick pass. They'll bring him down around the 38-yard line. So let's see how the defense responds now. It's first down and 10. As a man, he'll lose big yards. They're stopped for a five yard loss. This defense is fast enough that they can create negative yards on completed passes. So the offense Go might want to consider that Panthers. next time they try Panthers. that play. Motion, motion. Kill, kill. <laughs> He's got it with room to run. And they make the stop around the 30-yard line. What impresses me so much is the guy's vision. He read the coverage perfectly to find his man for good yardage. Back five, back five. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. These guys have the capability to gain solid, consistent yardage. They have to regroup, come out a bit more motivated next time. They call on the kicker for a long field goal. Minnesota up a point. It's up, looks long enough, and he nails the long field goal. They line up to kick this one away. He just drills this one. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Gains his way to the 33-yard line. Nice job by the running back, and that'll get him seven, maybe eight yards. So it's second down and about two yards to go. He wants it all. And it's caught to the 10. And he scores. Touchdown. <laughs> Trying to go up by three. They'll kick the extra point. And he converts the extra point. The return team looks ready to go. They need to take this one all the way in order to lead at the half. Sends it sailing downfield. 
And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Gets to about the 27-yard line. We've played a half. Miami in front, 13-10. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. This game's been everything we anticipated it being. Each team matching each other blow for blow. Just a one possession game at this point. What do you expect to change things in the second half? Well, it's always it's always fun to watch two teams and two gangs match up the hype. And we, we talked about it all week and how big this game is. And it's going to come down to players making plays. And, you know, the, the big play is something that we continue to beat into the ground. And which one doesn't give that up? A lot of times, you know, games are lost and won by turnovers and, and giving it away and making that crucial mistake. You can do everything right and you can execute right, but it just takes that one misstep, that one turnover to, to really put you in a bad position or a bad situation that can determine this game. That's what it looks like it's going to. Both teams executing well. Who's going to make a big mistake? Looking forward to seeing this second half. I think there's certainly a want for victory. A want and a need for victory. Some teams need this victory, Reese Davis. Want, need, got to go get it either way. Brad and Kirk are there to deliver. Very close game now as we start the second half. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. I love the competitive spirit that we're seeing out on this field today. It looks like one team has the upper hand, and then the other comes right back in to be able to regain the lead. It's going to be an exciting finish. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Down he goes at about the 33 yard line. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Here he goes. He's at midfield. And they bring him down at the 35 yard line. Looking to capitalize on the big run. Now it's first and ten. Makes it out to about the 20. three yards to pick up the first down. Brought down at the 18-yard line. Ouch. Pretty big loss on the play, and I think they might want to reassess the strategy here. Perhaps run a screen. Maybe hit the tight end on a short pattern. This D-line is just a bit much to handle at this moment. Smart, heady play by that defender. That was solid, fundamental pass defense. They'll line it up for the field goal. Minnesota is looking to tie things up. Kicks up, and they tack on three points. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. 
You don't want to squander any possessions, but maybe now's the right time to dip into your bag of tricks a little. Think about some gadget plays to catch the defense napping. Now he's scrambling. And he's taken down at the 37-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 37. It's caught first down, and he's out of bounds. That's good for a gain of 13 yards. That makes it first and 10. Three down, three down. Mike one, Mike one. Ready, Ray. Caught open field. Tackle made at the 37. Gain of 13 on the play. First down. From the 37-yard line. First down. Scrambling around. And he's tackled at the 21. Game of 16 yards. First down. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. Nice move, and he scores. Great call by the offensive coordinator. Big time play, taking that ball all the way in. Maybe the defense wasn't expecting a run. And he adds the extra point. Miami is ready to kick it away. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Wow, close game here. And up and down the field with both these offenses matching what the others done. Well, it's fun to watch each offense get an opportunity to go out and make plays. And you're right, you almost feel as, as if one offense feels challenged and has to be able to bounce back, and they've done that. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Down! Blue 19! Gains his way to the 36-yard line. First and 10. Ball on their own 36. Gets it out to about the 47-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 47-yard line. Tackled for a loss. You know, sometimes the defense just has a beat on an option, and there's no way the offense can gain positive yards on it. They come out in a five-wide set. There's a strike complete. He's at the 40. Tackle at the 19. First and 10, ball on the 19. He was never able to get ahead of steam on that carry. That is a loss of one yard. That'll bring up second and 11. Check 
59, Mike. Mike Red 59. two, green eight. Motion, motion. Go. Inside the 10, big play there, and now they're looking at first and goal. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Touchdown, Golden Gophers. Oh, that's a great job of some tough running right there. When you get close to the end zone, things get very tight. And it's tough to maneuver. And again, we're looking at a tie game. Man, a lot. This one really looks like it's going to come down to the finish. The extra point to tie this game up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A seven-play, 75-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. And Brad, right now, the offensive line just winning the battle in the trenches, opening up some big runs. Minnesota gets set to kick this one away. Nice kick, plenty of distance, and they can forget about returning this one. Miami's a team on a mission right now, it appears. They have put up 20 points in a row. I think it says something about the quality of the preparation of both teams that we're into the third quarter and nobody's been able to pull away. Both sides seem to know what to expect. He gets rid of this one. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 25. Oh, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman. When the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday on that one. your goal on every possession. Force a three and out, and don't allow the offense to get into any sort of rhythm. The defense decided to go conservative, sitting back in cover three. They wanted to make sure the receiver was not going to get open past the first down line on that play. He really got a hold of that one. Whoa, he just took a lick at him. So we played three quarters of football, and with one quarter to go, we're in a deadlock. We played three quarters even. Fourth quarter is going to tell the difference. This is when things get a little prickly. You need your playmakers to really come through here. Makes the catch and look out. He's tackled the 49-yard line. their own 49-yard line. It's first down. Well, give the defense all the credit here. They had that one snuffed out from the start. It could have been an even bigger loss. Up second and 13. Sack. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush because sacks can be real drive killers. What are you doing? Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 41. Three down, three down. Three down, three down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Black five, black five, X7. That's the motion. That's the motion. Incomplete, and that wasn't the greatest pass in the world. Well, I don't know how anybody can throw a great pass while getting drilled like that. that makes it fourth and long. And this one is a beauty. 
He takes it at the 12. And he's tackled at the 18. So he got a little on that return. Well, Brad, early it looked like there was an opening there, but the seam closed quickly. We might have overtime in the back of our minds, but down on the field, that hasn't occurred to anyone. They want to end this thing in regulation. Catches it, and that's all. That'll be a seven-yard pickup. That's a good completion. They didn't get the first down, but they picked up about seven yards. So it's second down and about two yards to go. Four down, four down. Mike number one, Mike number one. Let's go. They work the right side, and there is nothing going there. That is exactly the type of play that good linebackers make on a regular basis. And if you can make enough of them in college, probably going to get a chance to play at the next level. Calls it in past the marker. And he's leveled at the 30-yard line. That's, That's good, good for a gain of five yards. yards. First down, 10 to go. Ball on their own 30. Quick pass, and he's right there to knock it away. Well defended that time. You're right. Great job here by the defender playing the ball, keeping his balance, and getting in the way of that pass. Less than three minutes in the game. Ready. Bring Fires quickly, and he's got his man. They'll bring him down around the 46-yard line. That's a game of 16 on the play. First down. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 46-yard line. Oh, and he can't hang on. Huge drop there. play of this drive. He goes downtown. Can't connect. Brady drops the ball here. I don't know if he's starting to peek downfield and think about the return or what, but that ball's right in his hands. He just dropped it. Excellent punt. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. This is when things get a little prickly. You need your playmakers to really come through here. Second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. Less than two minutes in the fourth quarter. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. These guys have the capability to gain solid, consistent yardage. They have to regroup, come out a bit more motivated next time. Taken down at the 24-yard line. The offense couldn't get anything going that time. No, they couldn't. They really looked out of sync there, and they're going to have to make some adjustments to come back next time out. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. Tackle made to the 37-yard line. Late in the fourth quarter in a one-possession game. And poise is what it's all about here. Who's going to have it and who won't? Hit a 
as he threw, and he completes it. And they push him out at the 48. Call it a gain of 11 yards. First down. From their own 48-yard line. First down. Throws complete. He's got room to work. And down he goes around the 43-yard line. That's a gain of nine on the play. That brings up second and one. Throws a laser across the middle. And they make the stop at about the 31. Makes the tackle at the 31-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 31-yard line. Let's go! Red 18! Red! Check, check! Big Nice pitch and catch for the first down. Game 15 on the play. First down. Under a minute left in the game. Let's go! Red 18! Red! Brought down at the eight yard line. That's good for a game of eight yards. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. He gets out to about the six yard line. If I'm a defensive coordinator and I'm facing an offense that's working the clock like this, I cannot give up first down. So what do I do? I've got to attack the gaps. I got to shoot low with the defensive line, and I got to get my linebackers and safeties up close to the line of scrimmage so I can't give up any short yards at all and eventually give up the first down. And this one's all but wrapped up. The Hurricanes get the victory 23-20. So that wraps things up for us for EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit. I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.